What's good? It's your boy CJ Goodfella today with the Boxing Clinic. And, you know, shout out to my boy Cray over at IOTBA Boxing doing this thing. Y'all follow his channel. Follow him on Facebook. Um, follow my boys at Colossal Boxing Talking on Facebook and YouTube. But I must address the bullshit. <laughs> you know what I mean? You know who said that. You know my nigga correct. I must address the bullshit on Felix for day, ho. You know, I remember going back, you know, watching Andrew and Broner versus Ponce de Leon. I know a lot of people remember that fight. And instantly, Broner was labeled overrated. He got a robbery. Felix Verdejo has been in several of those fights. And not even on that competition level yet. It's so bad. People still clamor for this motherfucker and say he the future of boxing. Well, well, you know, Masao Zomachenko said he was the hardest fight he had in the amateurs. Big fucking whoop de doo You know what I'm saying? That's the amateurs. These the pros. This motherfucker got hand problems, falling off uh, car, uh, motorcycles and shit, and then get in the ring and don't have no type of fucking aggression out there. Of course, he looks the part physically. But past those fucking amateur four, rounds four, five, six, motherfuckers be getting in that ass. And ain't nobody impressed with him. Nobody. But people who support him, oh, you know, he's 20, he's young. He's 22 years old. But y'all the same motherfucker who fought Errol Spence for being his age. Well, Errol Spence is 26 years old. What is he waiting on? What is he waiting on? You know, you know what I'm saying? You the same motherfuckers who say, oh, age don't matter about Canelo Alvarez. Put him in with Golovkin. Put him in there with Floyd Mayweather. Age doesn't matter. So... This dude hasn't even stepped up yet, and, and he's already facing adversity that his talent level, air quote, supposedly say he shouldn't even be facing yet. So if he gets in there with the real banger, he's going to get fucked up. He's lucky 135 ain't as deep as, as, as deep as some of the other divisions. Like 154, this dude's on this level like Erickson Lubin, who's about the same age or even a little younger than him in the middleweight division. That'll tear that ass head off. I know it's a different weight class, but I'm talking about where they at skills-wise. You know what I mean? And people keep saying, oh, just be patient. How motherfucking long I'm going to be patient? You've been pumping this motherfucker up for two or three years now. And, of course, Vasado Machenko going to fucking give him um, a vote of confidence because they on the same fucking label. He hope he do good so he can beat that ass and cash out on his ass. But at the same time, man, you see he does have some skills. Should a corner, corner be switched? I don't know. This corner man is mad as fuck at him right now. So, who can help him? I don't know. Will he live up to his potential? I say he still lives up to a certain amount of his potential, but he's not going to be as big as people th- thought he was coming out the amateurs. We gone.